Hey peaches, so yes, I'm wearing a purple chef's jacket because I'm fancy schmancy like that. Um, anyways, today I am going to cook dinner and show you guys how I make stuffed pork chops with mini baby potatoes and butter and parsley. So without further ado, here we go. Alright, so as you guys can see on the back burner there, um, I've already got the potatoes on boil because they're going to take the longest. So boil the potatoes until they are um, easy to pierce through with a fork. Then I'm going to take this seasoned stuffing, it's store bought, you know, you just put it in water and cook it, microwave it, whatever. You can stuff the pork chops with your, you know, homemade stuffing if you want to, but I just use this because it's easy. Alright, so I'm going to use this pot for the stuffing. So the first thing I have to put into the pot is a cup of water and two tablespoons of butter. Alright, so while the water is boiling, I'm actually going to get the pork chops ready. I'm going to make two because I'm hungry. <laughs> Usually I eat one or two pork chops depending on how big they are. It all depends. Um, these are boneless, by the way. It's best to have boneless pork chops. Take a knife. You're going to cut a pocket in the meat, which sounds kind of weird, but that's what you do because the stuffing is going to go inside. Okay, so the water's boiling, so open up your package of stuffing. Pour it on in there. I opened this in one of the dumbest ways possible. Just pour all that in. Stir the contents in. So because of the fact that the oven, or the stove top rather, seems to hate me, I moved my potatoes over to this burner because that burner in the corner, that silly little burner, was not working for me. Alright, so there's our pork chops and here's our lovely stuffing. Okay, so they're all stuffed now and it's time for the cooking process. So now what you want to do is take a pan. I'm only using canola oil. So the potatoes are done boiling and I'm going to drain them and then show you guys what to do next while I'm waiting for my pork chop pan to heat up. Alright, so to the potatoes I'm going to add um, about a spoonful of butter and some of these dehydrated parsley flakes. Alright, so they're ready to be flipped quite soon. Ah, and if the oil is popping up at you, make sure you wear a oven mitt. So once they look beautiful golden brown like that, you're actually going to transfer them to a uh, baking, uh, what is this called, a baking pan? I don't know. <laughs> a baking dish and uh, bake them for around 25 to 30 minutes. That looks pretty gnarly, but that's easily cleanable. And this is what you should have at the end. Alright, so that's all guys. Uh, like if you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to comment, favorite, subscribe if you'd like to see more videos from me. And that's about it. I'm actually going to go sit down and eat my dinner, so peace. I love you all. Live, laugh, love, and have a good day or night, depending when you watch this video. And I'll see you guys next time with a brand new video.